All right, in previous video, we just gave you an overview of where the folders are, and it's in the eric.config here, at a call DWM. So in your .config, the stuff, the application. Well, the stuff to make the application is here, plus the things that we need, like the keyboard bindings. Control Alt F, what's going to do that? Ah, it's going to launch Firefox. Control Alt V will launch something if, yeah, if Vivaldi is installed. Super F1 is gonna launch something if Atom is installed. Super F2 is gonna do something, F3. Now Super F1 is Vivaldi, I think. F4 is not installed, F5 may be installed, voila. I do love my Melt. Melt is the way to compare. That's Super F. Uh, so, sorry, Super F5. And it's going to be Super F5 everywhere on all the 20 desktops. Maybe we should talk about keyboard key bindings first. That's easy. Let's get the easy part out of the way and then get to the config H and the config dev H and the building and all that. This is actually also an easy part. Hmm. Okay. So the what we call sometimes we joke to each other and we don't know the the normal name anymore. We call it the sexy hotkey demon, right? But it's a simple X hotkey demon. And what it contains, if it starts, the application must must start. Ooh, I don't have anything useful. By that I mean pseudo Pacman. Ooh, let's get me myself by this one. Pseudo Pacman minus S sublime text. I rather would like to work in another like this one. Because sublime text can also open things in hidden, well hidden, in things where um, I can't write normally. And it'll pop up a root password or a pop-up and it says, what's your password? So here you go. So Super F1, it's going to launch Vivaldi Stable. What well, you know, that's not installed. So yeah, if you want that thing to work, you have to install Vivaldi. Super F1, Vivaldi launches, Super Q, and I close it again. Atom is not installed, so Super F2 won't do anything, and so on. But these are the keyboard shortcuts that are in all our 20 desktops. And in the future, 21, 22, 23, that's our vision, right? Key memory, the, 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 some, sorry, the finger memory. We know what to type because we, we are used to it. The, the fingers find the, the applications before we even know it. But this is DWM, so Super Shift D is our menu. This is our, well, my menu. <laughs> doesn't have to be your memory, uh, your menu. And why do I say that? Because I see here Rofi, right? Rofi Super F11, uh-huh, Super F12. I know people like to use this one and then design it and color it, great. It's there. Alt F3, when you start out in Linux, you don't actually know sometimes what's the application I should use what's the name again because if you don't have the name super shift d can't help you what should i type if you don't know the first letter or any letter like printer for instance then you know ah i'm gonna set up my printer system config printer need to start services and connect so this is still not set well, let's include that as well easy way to connect it we go to main install Samba, install networks, install all kind of things you might want to use. But in this case, my friends, we need to do a scale. It's uh, changed. A little bit of cleanup that I've done. So all these guys are gone. And they're now in folders. Swap file and Samba and the Linux kernel, everything, if you have problems with keys, it's here, and a general fixes thing. So you can find these things easier, I think, I hope, right? And here again, the signing keys. Okay. 
So this is cups, getting cups to work. That's something else. I was thinking maybe I should include also a uh, script for that. Anyway, super X, I just by mistake typed something. Super X, that's your super X. You can do whatever you want here. That's not what I wanted to do. I want a super Q, of course, and super Q again. So there are lots of possibilities to get to menus. That's the point. And how do you start learning any desktop is read. Okay, so Rofi Super F12. I like this smaller one. Again, you should know the words to type. So printer. Okay, so I have to go here and so on. Vivaldi, Vival. Okay, got it. And over and away you are. Okay. So Conky toggle is here. So means to toggle on, off, on, off. Conky is on, Conky off. Some of these things have been hidden. You see, dash. This is not going to work. Super H is out. We don't use it. Super H, if you want to use it, then you have to enable it. But see what it does. Super H is doing something for us. That's why it's out. Powerful control is there. Praga, I mean, it's not installed, it's out. Super escape, super nice, super escape. Look at the design. What am I gonna kill? Because that's it, X kill. I'm gonna kill something. Super, so again, sorry, super X kill. Okay, so you can read all that. You can also change the colors here for the D menu, Super Shift D. Don't like this yellow, but it's everywhere yellow. Why not another color? Sure, no problem. This is actually the standard D menu run. This is the look it's normally. So white and bluish, maybe like this. Don't say anything behind it and you get this. So it's already some kind of design tweak thing. I'll control all W, it's all supposed to work. But the W, Eric, is there for me. The W, why did we choose W, right? QWERTY and Azerty keys. And lots and lots and lots of more things. I'll let you read all these files. And let's go back to the rest. So let's keep it um, the simple things first. So key bindings are here. Then we go to Arco DWM. That's all in here. That's the file, key bindings. How do we launch the key bindings? In Auto Start. I think. Let's have a look. So we're starting with the welcome app. Okay. If the welcome app is present in the config Auto Start, then we boot it. These are all things for later if you have more than one screen. The network manager is here, PAMAC tray is here, Write is here. It's not there next time around. Just a hashtag and it's not going to be there. Notification demons, blueberry tray, don't have blueberry. Put the hashtag in front of it. Icon, it's a reference to the file here. So that's the transparency and um, the shadows, shadows, here's shadows, transparency, opacity, that's how they say it here. And fading, all these elements can be changed, are there, are available, that's that. The guys with laptops, yep, yeah, sorry, but the numlock is on by default. So if you don't want that, then it's gonna be off by default. It just matters if you have a separate keypad. Um, or not. Volume icon, yep, is there. It's a fun little thing because it has the ability to immediately go to preferences. So right mouse click, open mixer, ah, uh, sorry, yeah, open mixer, all preferences. I know Control Alt U is going to open to Pavu Control. So who cares, right? So it's another way of, of doing things like Super Shift D is also great if you know the, no the name, you should always know the name. So we're going over some things here. SL status, that's something already about DWM. It's a package that provides this, 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 and this. And we had some fun, <laughs> we had some fun. Let's include that in the video. 
if we click on here, we get this. So this is XFCE because sometimes, and that's a good tip actually, sometimes melt stays in the processes. It's gone, but it's not gone. And then you press Super F5 and you want to launch melt again, nothing happens. You have two lines here that say melt has started, but you should kill them. So right mouse click, kill melt, kill melt twice now, and then everything will start again. So sometimes if you are experimenting with your system, you do, do not do a clean uh, stop or quit of melt. Yeah, it, the process still lives on in the system and then it won't load. All right, so what else? Maybe let's quit this thing. So this guy, same thing. So it, it's, it ends here, I think. And uh, even here, but at some point, so still that one. So it's right mouse click, okay. Here is all right mouse click. So the right mouse click is our, um, well, calendar to quickly see uh, what it is. To get it this away, I always think, hey, why it's not going away? Just click again, right mouse click, right mouse click. The same place, then it's away. I believe there's one more and uh, Steven is using this one often, he says. Look, two nor opened. So up here, if you happen to be up there, you can use your middle mouse click and it opens or two nor. Right? It's all about what the workflow you're used to. Super shift enter is my thing, right? It's gonna open through and like that. There's also, no, this is not, no, okay. Uh, don't say anything. <laughs> this is how I do things. And then the wallpaper. We've seen the wallpaper, that the Arco Linux wallpaper is there. And then more things you wanna start up with Spotify and immediately, this is for a coarse air colored uh, keyboard. Discord needs to be there, Telegram needs to be there. You start up with the things you like and love. What have we been telling you until now? This one, Pykem, and the last thing that's not really related, this was related, of course, this is the only one, line 29, that's related to DWM. In here we have a script that says Toho. So Pycom off, Pycom on, Pycom off, Pycom on. So it means transparency in a terminal or not. So on and off and on and off. That's, that's the only thing. And this is launched, I think, with Control Alt O if I'm not mistaken. How do we quickly know that? Control Find, Pycom. There you go, Control Alt O. So keep all the stuff open and do a search. Control Alt O. Now, I can't show you this. Like I said, I'm in VirtualBox. So I need to set things, but it doesn't matter. You know, you'll see on real metal it works. Okay, I think that's gonna be another video. Maybe this one, but the only thing this is, is what we started with. When we have a conky, this thing here, that's for you to help you, uh, Alt F2, we discussed, did not discuss Alt F2, but we did Alt F3. And Alt F3 is actually XFC, right? And Alt F2 is a very smaller thing, but yeah, again, you need to know that Kaka Fire is nothing uh, dirty, but it's just this. And if you don't know, right? There is don't know the name, can't launch it. So this thing, um, the other day somebody asked something on, on Discord. That's just a file, eh? it's never going to be updated. It, this is a standard file for um, all our tiling window manager actually. So it's just there to help you and you can just get rid of it and it's very easy. And don't delete anything, I do super C. Bye, it's gone. Okay. The rest is really is, so this one, this one, that's text from us, I'll explain later. And then that's from us to start everything. And then we have the, the sexy hotkey demo, let's say it again. 
with a smile on her face, right? And then the scripts to toggle. And then we have set all the things that are, let's say, that easy. Okay, and then we'll tackle DWM.